everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are going to talk about the 20 most affordable bags in louis vuitton right now in 2024 and i'm making this video because i know that there's no filter for louis vuitton websites for you to search which are the bags that are the most affordable according to your budget so this is a guideline for you if you are finding or you're trying to get your first bag and under a budget or you just really wanted to add another handbag to your collection and uh, you wanted something that it's within a budget so the bags that i'm going to talk about is less than 2000 usd yes and i'm talking about usd today because 70% of my audience are from US. Hello, if you are watching from US. And I'm also going to include the price in SGD. But uh, currently, all the bags that I'm going to talk about is less than 2000 USD. So uh, keep watching if you want to know more about this 10 bags that are less than 2000 USD. Enjoy. Just a quick one, if you're new to the channel, my name is Murphy and currently as I'm recording this video, I am a sales advisor here in Louis Vuitton, Singapore. This channel is all about Louis Vuitton products, Louis Vuitton update, luxury brands in general. So if you are into this kind of things, please do not forget to subscribe. Okay, first on the list is the Pochette Felici. Pochette Felici is actually one of the favorites of most people who are looking for a small bag and they feel that this is worth it to get because you get two more wallet flat wallet like pouch is a pouch flat wallet like insert inside that you can also use separately with a price of 1490 usd and in singapore dollars is 2090 this is an absolutely worth it bag just for a weekend for day to day because a phone and a small wallet can fit inside and if you're going to use the insert you don't even need a wallet because the insert itself is a card holder and a coin holder yeah because the other insert has a zip on it so this is totally worth it 1490 it comes with a chain strap that you can use as a crossbody and also a shoulder carry so uh I think also for a casual and uh, a little bit dressy occasion, you can definitely wear this. So 1490, totally worth it for a small bag. The next one I am going to talk about is one of my favorite bags and it's a new bag that has been launched last year. And I'm talking about the IV Wallet on Chain. LV Wallet on Chain is, to, is actually one of the most practical wallet on chain that you could get because compared to the pochette felici this has a leather strap that you can use as a crossbody and a shoulder carry so that gives it a different look than the pochette felici it is uh thicker and it is more rounder compared to the pochette felici it has a more modern vibe and uh, a fashionable vibe and also it comes with a short train chain that you can use as a shoulder carry as well um, I have a review about this bag, so uh, just search it, in my, search it in my channel if you want to know more about this bag. But this is highly recommended because the style is something that will never go out of trend. So uh, yeah, I, I would highly recommend this bag with a price of 1760 USD or 2570 SGD. This is a bag under 2000 USD that you could get as your first bag or an additional to your collection. The next one I am going to talk about is the Lily Wallet and Chain. The Lily Wallet and Chain is also uh, a small bag that you could get as a, as a weekend bag. I wouldn't say that it could be day to day bag because it's too small. It has a completely different vibe and look compared to Pochette Felicity and Wallet on Chain because it has this uh, vintage look with that uh, metal logo in front, the shape. It is a completely vintage look in my opinion so uh, one thing i love this about this bag aside from it being spacious enough for your phone and your wallet is that the chain is very creative because the chain contains of two parts where you can play around with the length and also one thing i have discovered about this is that you can wear it as a belt could you believe that it is uh, it is this is how it looks like when it's worn as a belt it is very very cute you can use it as a crossbody shoulder carry and um, yeah and the chain itself you can use it as a belt in a plain dress or even a plain high waist skirt so it's like getting two in one with a price of 1670 usd 
uh, Singapore dollars, 2,400. It is a bag that you could get if you are a person who has this kind of vintage vibe to your outfits and to your wardrobe. Next one, Nano Noe. Uh, this bag, this small handbag, is a classic shape from the Noe itself. That is a classic bag of Louis Vuitton, but it's a miniature size and I know everyone loves miniature size. It comes with an adjustable strap. It comes with a handle. Your phone depends on your phone. Um, if you're using iPhone Pro Max, it may be a little bit uh, too big. It might, uh, the, the top of your phone might be out when you use it, but if you're using a normal iPhone, it can definitely fit in. It is still practical. It's cute when it's worn. I love it personally because it is one of an outstanding bag. So um, Nano Noe is something that I would recommend if you're looking for a classic shape that is uh, recognizable as a Louis Vuitton shape and something that you can keep for a long time. For the price of 1620 it is very worth it. Uh, 2670 in SGD. It is an absolutely good bag to add to your collection if you are collecting Louis Vuitton bag because no way is a classic shape. Next is the Nano Speedy. The Nano Speedy, it has been very popular in 2018 to maybe 2021. Now the trend is going down, but it is still a classic shape that you can consider because Speedy is the first Louis Vuitton soft-sided bag for women and uh, no other bag could be recognizable as Louis Vuitton as much as Speedy bag and I'm going to discuss the regular size later but for now this is a miniature size for small bag lovers the price is 1760 and uh, in SGD is 2670 and uh, if you're wondering like this is not the direct conversion of USD and SGD this is uh, the prices in the store right now as I'm recording this video in uh, June, what day is today? June 15 or 16. I, <laughs> I completely didn't get track of the dates now, but yeah. So uh, today, as I'm recording this video and as you're watching this video, these are the current prices. So 1760 is a very good price, less than 2000 USD uh, for a classic shape, totally worth it. Next in line is the pochette accessoire and this is not the old pochette accessoire as you know before that just comes with the leather strap. Now Louis Vuitton discontinued that and uh, came out with a, a new version with a chain and with a leather strap that is removable. Uh, the price is uh, 2250 SGD and this is the price in USD. I haven't checked it yet as I'm recording this video because this is the last one on my list. So I'm sure this is less than... Uh, 2000 SG, uh, USD and um, it's also a classic shape. It has been very popular at the same time as the Nano Speedy. I would say that this is a very simple rectangular shape of bag. Also will never go out of trend but if you're looking for a more stylish bag this is not the one I would go for No Way or um, the Nano Speedy which is uh, classic shapes of Louis Vuitton but uh, some of my clients love the simple shape, the simple rectangular shape that you can wear as a shoulder carry. The disadvantage of this is that you cannot carry this as a crossbody unless you're going to buy a separate strap. You can also, you know, you can buy this type of strap in Louis Vuitton. But uh, if you're okay with a shoulder, short shoulder carry, which has a very vintage vibe, very 80s and 90s vibe of bag, this is actually perfect. And uh, there are two straps that you can wear with it. So you can switch it over to a more casual or a more dressy outfit. This is a very good price. The next one is uh, also a classic shape. It's the Alma BB. Alma is also a very classic style of Louis Vuitton bag. And uh, the price of it is 1760 and SGD is 2670. It is a good price for a bag like this. This is bigger than the previous ones that I discussed about. So if you have more things but you still want a, uh, a practical bag in a price that is less than 2000 USD, then this is a bag for you. The base is big enough for all your things to fit inside. You can put an extra small uh, maybe makeup kit compared to the other wallet on chain that I just discussed about. Now it comes with an adjustable strap. The new version comes with an adjustable strap which is good because the previous ones, the, the, the strap 
for Asian height, at least for my height, I'm always basing it on me. Uh, it's too long, but now it's adjustable, so it's actually a good, uh, a good deal. You don't have to send it back to the workshop to have it cut and pay extra. So um, yeah, Alma BB is a good uh, bag to have. For me, this bag is good when handheld. Once it's shouldered carry with my shape of body, it looks too bulky. But uh, for some people who are taller than me, who has a very nice structure of uh, body and height, it is okay. So it depends. So it's very important to try it in the store if you want to get it. Next in line is the Noe BB. The Noe BB is the bigger size of Neo Noe. And uh, this is a very, very practical. If you're gonna compare it to Alma BB, it's almost double the price, I mean, double the size, but the price is almost the same, is it? But the price is, the price difference is not a lot. So, the price of Noe BB currently is 1730 USD and 2850 SGD. It is totally worth it. For SGD, there's a price difference a little bit higher, but for USD, it is $30 USD lower than Alma BB. This can be used as a day-to-day -day bag if you are a mom or if you're going to an office or if you are a student. This is a very practical bag. No way BB because of its uh, bucket-shaped bag. It has this 90s, 80s vibe. So it has the vintage look, but at the same time, it is it doesn't look like it's out of trend. So if you are looking for a first bag that is practical, No way BB is a very good price of a medium-sized bag. The next one I am going to talk about is the Neverfull PM. So the Neverfull PM is 1960, still below 2000. And uh, the SGD price is 2760. So um, for this one, Neverfull PM is quite tricky because at least in our store or in Singapore itself, it's, gonna, it's difficult to get it already. So uh, if you're in US or if you are in other countries and if you want to get this bag you can ask your SA if it's still available for them for us sometimes it's open for order sometimes it's not so I'm not sure if this bag is going to be obsolete soon because that is a sign of a bag being obsolete soon if it, the stocks are not coming in healthily but this is not an announcement it's just my speculation uh, based on my experience but uh, right now there's a Noe BB which the price is way way higher than uh, never full PM but never full PM the size is still very practical you can put day-to-day -day essentials inside and uh, it comes with a short strap that you can shoulder carry for some people it may be too tight for their shoulders it depends on the person wearing it so it's very important to try it nevertheless it's still a very practical bag and for 1960 usd it's still a very good price last but not the least is the speedy 25 and 30. so speedy 25 is price of 1490 very good price for this size of bag SGD is 2280 for Speedy 30, 1550 USD and 2370 SGD. The prices are very, very good. It's way cheaper than the uh, miniature bag or small bags, the nano bags. Uh, if you're going to ask me why, I don't know why, but uh, this bag does not have a structured shape. So uh, once you put a heavy thing on it, the base is actually sagging so uh, it's very important to have a organizer with this bag nevertheless this is a classic bag this is again a bag that will never go out of shape this is the very first Louis Vuitton soft-sided bag after Louis Vuitton making trunks uh, this is designed by the grandson of Louis Vuitton which is Gaston and the very first person who wore this is Audrey Hepburn which is a fashion icon until now so uh, if you are looking for a bag that is practical can put your things inside I mean put all your essentials inside this two bags these two sizes of Speedy is still within a budget of less than 2000 this one comes with a adjustable strap you can use it as shoulder carry and crossbody uh, but then again, for crossbody, I would only recommend a 25 because PD30 is it's too big for a crossbody, especially if you're not very tall. So um, keep that in mind. Try it and see how you feel about it. But this is a very good price for this size of bag. And of course, if you are uh, looking for your 
first Louis Vuitton bag and you want it to be classic, you can go for a speedy. There are a lot of other choices of material if you're not into canvas, but I'm talking about the canvas now because of the topic of this video, which is less than uh, 2000 USD. So these are all the 10 bags that I have gathered to be less than 2000 USD. I hope you find it helpful. And as you noticed, I have only talked about the uh, canvas material, which are the, men, uh, the monogram or some bags also comes in damier but not all of them so uh, i am um, if you like this video i would probably make one for leather versions but uh, for now let me know which one you have already or which one are you planning to buy soon or how helpful do you find this video your feedback is very important to me so that i can base it on the future videos that i'm going to make so uh, for now i'm gonna say goodbye and uh, i will see you on the next one